getting around made it relaxing and exciting. Just like surfboard, the skateboard vary in size and function. The approximate 71 to 84 cm standard skate deck is great for performing tricks. Mini board, also known as short boards, can be as short as 30 cm. They, they are small enough to carry but allow riders to do some cool tricks. Long boards for at the another end the other end of the spectrum. Getting from point A to point B. Range, ranging from eighty four to more than one hundred fifty cm in length. Long board look like other skateboard. They what they were born for from the desire to surf concrete when real waves were low. However, longboard were dis were also designed with commuting commuting in mind. They can coast without a pushing for much longer than other skateboard. People choose longboard for the same reason that some commuters choose bikes. Both are, both are better for the environment compared to vehicles with motors. People who ride bikes may desire speed, while longboards, longboarders gener generally prefer a relaxed experience. What's more, it takes a, a different kind of skill to balance on longboard, the need for speed. Skill is certainly necessary when bumping a hill. This is the term that riders use for getting to the bottom of a paved hill as fast as possible. While it is possible to ride down a hill on a regular Skateboard. Most riders prefer longboard. Riders tend to feel more comfortable on longboard. This is because longboard is, longboards are more stable. However, inexperienced riders do need to practice before attempting a long ride down here. Wobbling posed by high speed can be nest, can be scary. Therefore, it, it is important and sometimes even required that riders need to wear safety helmets, gloves, and knee guards. In some places, a, a rider is required by law to have someone watch them. It could just be a friend or two. In other words, never bump alone. That isn't as fun anyway. Whether used for getting around town or or an exciting ride, a long bar can be the way to go.